What's up guys, I'm D. Thomas from NC, back with another video, and today we're gonna check out some Sony PlayStation on the HQ Megacade. Now if you're new around here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for all things Megacade. Also, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Without further ado, let's go ahead and check it out. All right, so we have the Sony PlayStation. Before I dive into this gameplay, let me show you guys something real quick. So let's just say you ordered your Mega Cade or pedestal and you didn't order wireless controllers because not everybody orders wireless controllers whenever they order one of these machines. So you still can play PlayStation games with the joysticks and buttons. All you're gonna do is come to the settings and you're gonna go to the PlayStation configuration. Once you're here, this right here is going to pop up. We're gonna use the trackball as the mouse and we're gonna to go to config right here. Once we're here, we're gonna go down to game pads. Hope you guys can see that. And then we're gonna come over to uh, port one, pad one. Now once you're here, you have the entire uh, PlayStation controller laid out right here. And all of these are mapped to go along with the Xbox 360 wireless controllers. But let's just say, like I said, if you ordered a machine and you didn't get those controllers, you can map these pretty easily. So let's just say hypothetically, right here, you've got the D-pad and you want to map it to the joysticks and buttons. Pretty easy to do. You're just gonna click on this right here and press up. And let's just say if you wanna move it to the left, you click here, press left. Same thing, guys. You wanna move it down, click here, and you press down. And as you can see, I am now mapping the D-pad to the joystick, all right? And then if you want to do the buttons, you got circle, square, X, and triangle. So let's just say if we want to change square to one of these buttons here, what we're gonna do, we're gonna click right here, and button one, now it is mapped. If I want to change X, I click here, and say if I want button two to be X, boom, there it is. So it's pretty easy if you want to map your PlayStation controls to the joysticks and buttons, it's pretty easy but I prefer to play it with the uh, Xbox 360 wireless controllers. So I don't want to keep those settings. So I'm just going to go to cancel and I'm going to exit out of that. And we're going to back out and we're going to head back up to the PlayStation. So let's scroll up and there we go. Sony PlayStation, y'all know who that is a stretched out Crash Bandicoot. All right, so we're gonna kick this off with a really dope game that I know a lot of people like. Let's go to the C's. And let me see, turn this down a little bit. That game is going to be none other than Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Real dope game. So let me get my wireless controllers. Got them sitting in the back right here. So now I have my wireless controller on and I'm ready to play. So let's go ahead and boot this game on up. You see you have the PlayStation borders on the left and right side. That's not too big of an eyesore for me. It's not too bad, like I don't mind it at all. I'm not too sure how to remove them, but like I said, I don't mind them being on the left and the right side. So let's go ahead and press start and boot this game on up. <clears throat> let's see, let's go to file select. Um, checking for a memory card, don't have one of those. Let's put in DT, NC, hit start. All right, so final stage of Bloodlines. You guys, if you played this game, you already know what to expect. And comment down below if you ever played or if this Castlevania was one of your favorite games to play back in the day. Right out the gate. It's time to get it in. Die, monster. Yeah, die, You don't belong monster. in this world. It was not by my hand that I'm once again given flesh. <laughs> I was called here by humans who wish to pay me tribute. Boy, stop lying. Tribute? Ain't nobody you call you. <laughs> steal men's souls and make them your slaves. Ain't nobody your slave. Perhaps the same could be said of all religions. Your words are as empty as your soul. Right, right. Mankind ill needs a savior such as you. Facts. What is a man? 
A miserable little pile of secrets. Huh? But enough talk. How about you? Yeah, let's get it, bro. Let's get it. That boy said enough talk. I'm tired of running my mouth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh he hit me with the little yoga flame. He threw out three of them. Yo, not. Oh, I missed. This dude got some ups on him, bro. You see how high I jump? <laughs> Come on, get that word. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Now I got to hit you with the Aquafina, AKA that holy water. Burn him up. I'm trying to burn him with that holy water. Burn. I miss. Oh, I still miss. <laughs> I keep missing, bro. Wasting all that good water. What's up? All right, let me go ahead and take him out, man. Dang it. Keep missing. <laughs> but don't worry, we're going to handle him. Oh, he about to, what am I doing? I'm standing here letting him hit me. Burn. I say burn. Jump over that. About guiding. And check out the music. Oh, come on, bro. Little girl gonna come out and help me out. Uh-oh. I thought I saw a master down. I'm about to turn into a Power Ranger out of this joint. <laughs> you really about to get it now. She done brought me back to life, bruh. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah. It's like I put a cheat code in or something. Come on, bro. How about guiding? He about dead, y'all. Look at this cat. Trying to trap me in the corner, bruh. Get your get that head rock. Get that head rock, bruh. Get hit with the holy water, bruh. Get hit with the aquafina, son. The 50 cent smart water. What's up? <laughs> oh snap, I'm throwing it the wrong way. Get hit with the aquafina, bruh. Yeah. Set him on fire. I know he did. All right, so this right here is one of the dopest basketball games to ever come out in my opinion, especially back in the PlayStation era. And this right here is NBA in the zone. This joint was so fire. Let's go to exhibition. And I wanna be home. And let's go to the East Coast. I'm gonna rock out with the Orlando Magic. Cause that was my favorite team back in the 90s. And let's go up against Reggie Miller and them boys. All right. And now, the Indiana Pacers versus the Orlando Magic. Let's get it. Now, if you compare the graphics from back then to the graphics of today, like an NBA 2K20, of course it looks night and day. But you got to admit, from back in the day, this drummer here was on point. Dennis Scott for three. Pull up. Let's go. Let's go. He gonna make that. So, yeah, like I was saying, the Orlando Magic block. Oh, he missed that finger roll. Oh, he got it back and went for a dunk. The Orlando Magic was my favorite team back in the 90s. Penny Hardaway. Is Shaquille in there running? Who's the center? I don't know if they had Shaquille then. We got Dennis Scott, Nick Anderson. Get that thing to Anthony Hardaway. Pump fake, oh. Oh, I can't get the lucky bounce. I try to do a pump fake. How do you steal on this game? Oh, get that out of here. I had to block him. Fast break. Nick Anderson, pull up. That's three. Oh, cash money. Let's go. So I don't think the Magic had Shaquille O'Neal at the time. I forgot who the center is. Block shot. Oh, did he dunk on me? Hey, Anthony Davis. Or Dale Davis. I said Anthony Davis. <laughs> All right, where you at, Anthony Hardaway? Pump fake. Oh, I keep trying to 
I keep trying to pump fake, man. That's jump. Oh, that's steal. Ooh, he did a reverse. He did a spin move and a reverse. Yeah, he got his showing out. All right. Come on, Penny. Penny was one of my favorite players, bro. Pull up. There we go. Ah, all right, let me leave. Get the, let me leave the threes to Nick Anderson and Dennis Scott, yo. Oh, no way. Give me that. All right, let's go. There we go. Straight to the paint, bro. And you can play this with the analog or the uh, D-pad. All you have to do is just press the uh, player one start button. Block. Oh, that was a foul? Ref, how you gonna call that? All you have to do is press player one start and it'll change the analog. And you can, uh, instead of using the D-pad, you can use the analog. Whatever you prefer. Man, go ahead and take the shot, bro. Oh, Derek McKee, I remember that cat. All right, let me get some of my other players love. Dennis Scott, I'm gonna let you pull up again. No, Nick Anderson. That's Cash. Ah, oh. who is my, I, I don't know who my center is. What? That's NBA Jam right there, bro. That's almost from the three point line. Rick Smith ain't got it like that, yo. <laughs> Golly. Ain't no way. Shoot. Hey, he doing it, I can do it too. That boy almost jumped from the three-point line, yo. That's that's borderline NBA jam, yo. Oh, y'all gotta chill out with the fouls. You can change the camera view too. Let's see what he pressed to change the camera view. Um uh, let me let him take these free throws. Let me see how you change this camera view. Uh, no, I hit the wrong button. You know that ain't going to go in. Hold on. Oh, you press select to change the camera view. I don't care for the side view. Here you go. Got him off his feet. Finger roll. Pump fake. Uh, nothing but net, bruh. So that's how you change the uh, camera view on this game. This is that NBA Live type view right here. Ooh. Let me change it back though. Let me try to get one at the buzzer. Uh, let's see. Oh, I switched players. I switched by accident. Oh, my controller died. Pull up, pull up. <laughs> my controller died. Don't just stay. Oh, golly. I'm trying to pop off. Oh. So there it is. NBA in the zone. <laughs> My dang old controller died. Let me change this battery out. <laughs> All right, so next up, we got Tekken 3. Let's go ahead and start out with the arcade mode. I know y'all remember this joint. Let's go with uh, Law. I am bringing the Law to you guys. You know I'm gonna get him to business, right? Law look like Bruce Lee. <laughs> Round one, fight. Oh. Ooh, let's go. Hit him with that fail off from Street Fighter. Oh. Get kicked back, boy. Jack move, son. Right to the face. Let's go. He's done. Let me turn this down a little bit. Let's go. Woo! Back up a little bit. That has to hurt, bruh. Oh! Smack him in the face. Oh, shoot, nice. Let me not get too cocky. Oh, I'll try to hit him with that flying Liu Kang kick. Oh, hit him with the gal flash kick. Flash kick, flash kick. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, you don't want it, man. Who up next? Oh, snap. Paul looking like a truck driver. Like, yo, you ain't even well, do that to me. Fight. All right, bro. Get your kid and play hot. Oh, get dealt with, son. Get dealt with. Oh, hit him with the flying Luke Cage. Can I get a perfect on this cat? 
One more hit. Oh, he messed my purse. Golly. What? He's cheesing me. Dang it, he messed up my perfect. Had him with, hit him with that cannon drill. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, wow. That joint took a lot of help. Come on, come on. Yeah. <clears throat> you a big fan of Tekken 3? Or the Tekken series at all? Oh! Yo, I can't lose this next one. <laughs> I cannot lose this next one. All right, run it back. Ooh. Oh shoot. I thought I blocked that. Oh shoot. Hit it with the flash kick. Ooh, I pulled it off. I thought he was gonna get me for a second, yo. <laughs> Golly. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Who up next? Uh, I don't wanna do this to you. Chun Lee cousin. Round but you're too happy. You got to go. Oh, shoot. Come here. Come here, Shawty. Oh, nice duck. Oh, she hit me with that spinning bird. Oh. Oh, shoot. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boy, she almost got me, dog. She hit me with that half spinning bird kick. Let's go. Run it back. Run it back, yo. All right. Oh, okay, she's a done deal. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, shoot. Yes, that's what did it, boy. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. So, yeah, I'm feeling like I'm pretty unstoppable right now. One more. Oh, snap. We got a live tie out this joint, bro. Round <laughs> one. Boy, ain't even Halloween, and you got on a pair of Fila sneakers? Come on. I can't take no grown man serious with a with a dang old mask, a cheetah mask on his face. <laughs> Come here, bro. Hit him with that double flash kick. Oh, nice. Kicked him like that. Then hit him with that two-piece special right from Popeyes. Let's go. <laughs> All right, let me whoop up on this cat, man. You shouldn't even be fighting anyway with them pants on. Look at them pants. Oh, shoot. Huh? Oh, shoot. Get some. Uh-huh. Hold up. Let up on them a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hit them with them Conor McGregor snacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so that's Tekken 3. Let me fight Jen and I'm going to wrap it up. Let me go against Jen. Round one. Cause he look like a fighter. See? He's ducking and dodging. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Ooh, need him in the face. Tiger. Had to hit that boy with a tiger knee. <laughs> Last one. Let's go ahead and do what we came to do. You know I'm the law around here, boy. Nice block. Get back. Get back. Oh! He dug the whole time. Did a, did a Ryu and Ken. Wow. I set myself up on that one. All right, separate the men from the boys right here. Stop with all that ducking, fam. Oh, nice. Oh, that's how I got beat last time. Got him. Two-piece straight from the dollar menu. McDonald's, hello. 
<laughs> so there it is, guys. Taking three. You want to see me with Law Holla at me? <laughs> And you should already know who this is just by the music alone. Dang, 1996? Bro, I cannot believe it's been dang near 14 years since we've seen this game. And there is the infamous Naughty Dog. We've gone from Crash Bandicoot to The Last of Us 2. <laughs> All right, so here it is. Crash Bandicoot. Oh, let me turn off the analog. <laughs> There we go. So let's go ahead and start right on up. They did a really good job at the remake of this game. I mean, if you look at how it used to be and you look at it now, it looks really good. So we are on the Insanity Beach. I'm gonna see if I can pass this level with flying colors. Cause you know, a lot of people say this game used to be really hard. Oh, let me turn the volume up a little bit. All right, there we go. Let's get back, boy. Jump over that like so. Give me all my apples. They look like apples. Nothing in there? Nope. Let me hold that. Jump over that like that. Booga booga. Remember we used to say something like that? That. Ooh, God. Ooh, God. Get up there, bro. I don't know if it. Hold on, let me go back and get these boxes, huh? There you go, extra life right there. Almost went past it. I said these were apples, but they look. I don't know what kind of fruit this is, bro. They look sweet, though, whatever they are. Go this way, go that way. There we go. Got the checkpoint. Get out of here, Ninja. Look, it's a Ninja Turtle. It looks like a turtle. Get out of here, boy. Oh, shoot. I almost fell off. Oh, I gotta be careful. Oh. No, that almost went past that. Let me hold all of those. So, so far, so good, man. Let's go to the right. Not hard at all. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I fell right in the hole, bruh. Dang. I didn't mean for that to happen. Hit the button too late. There we go. Let's get past it this time. All right. Jump. Let me hold that. Give me all of these. You guys remember playing Crash Bandicoot? I remember those commercials. When Crash the dude used to be dressed up as Crash Bandicoot outside Nintendo headquarters, talking trash. That was so dope. Because can you imagine if, like, oh, shoot. Can you imagine if, if Nintendo and PlayStation would have actually came together and we would have had a Nintendo PlayStation? All of Nintendo's first party games, with the, with the along with everything that Sony has brought to the table, that would have been super dope. You know what? I should have went back the other way. To the left. I know I probably shouldn't be doing this. But I missed, I feel like I missed out on some stuff. Just a little bit of fruit. Uh, let me just go on to the end. <laughs> I don't want to kill myself. Oh, here we go. So there it is. I made it to the end. Flying colors. All right, so this game right here is called R-Type Delta. Let's go ahead and start this on up. Whenever you get to the title screen, it looks like this, but rest assured, it does work, and that's why I wanted to show you this gameplay. So let's go ahead and start game. Do you wish to continue? Of course. R-Type Delta. So you see the city is on fire, but your boy is here to save the day. And this is the very first time our type was like in 3D. So let's go ahead and handle business, bro. Nobody's getting away from me. And you know, back in the day, these side, these side shooters were pretty dope. Let me hold that. Let me charge the beam up. 
get out of here, boy. Charge that beam up. Fall back, son. Killing everything that's moving. And you know, Super Nintendo had a Super Hard type, and that game was pretty dope too. Get back in the old lap. So, joints bouncing off the walls. Oh, shoot! <laughs> Dang, I didn't even see that little gun down there. Got hit by a little old bullet, man. Dang it. So you know how this goes, it's a one hit a quitter. You get hit one time, you gotta start over, man. But not from the beginning, but you know. Fall back, let me hold up. Okay, that's the little dude that killed me last time. Uh -huh, not today. Oh, he almost got me. Almost got shot again. Let me hold that. Got those missiles. Oh, shoot. Kind of reminds me of the, uh, the... Oh, shoot. Got to drop missiles on his head. Bro, I'm so about to get killed. <laughs> I almost hit that joint twice. So this joint right here, ricochet off of everything. Oh, die the bullets. I still got the skills to pay the bills. I hear playing like a 90s kid, like I know what I'm doing. Shoot. Why did I go behind him? Should've stayed, oh, I mean, why did I go in front of him? Should've stayed behind him. So even though on the title screen you can't really see, oh, what just happened? Did I die? What hit me? Ah. Uh, but even though you can't see the, uh, the logo when the game starts up, you still see that the gameplay looks good. I don't even remember getting hit just now. I'm so busy running my mouth. I thought I was dodging everything like a, like a boss. Oh, shoot. Oh, you know, I, I see I got a little health meter. Or oh, maybe I ran into that building just now. I don't know. I lost all my cool guns. But anyways, this is R-Type Delta. Oh, shoot. See him hiding behind the wall. Y'all already know what this is. The Contra Adventure. So the alien forces have begun to aggressively attack the capital city. That's all you need to say. You don't need to say anything else. But I can't skip past this because it's kind of like it's still loading. So you can't bypass this. But now, let's go. You see I'm out here with my gun. Let's get it. Let me know if you ever played this console. Got the flamethrower. Get out of here, boy. And you know, most other Contra games that you play, you have, uh, it's a one hit a quitter. But this right here, you have an energy bar. I done got hit like three times already. I'm still not dead. How do I switch weapons? Oh, there we go. And I think you can hold like, I think you can hold like, I don't know, like five different weapons. But I'm about to die right now. I don't step my game up. Kill him, kill him, there we go. So yeah, this is definitely a Contra game that I find pretty fun and I think it's worth it. Shoot. I think it's worth checking out. Oh shoot. In the event you get your Mega K. Oh, I got full health. There we go. Get the flame. I need a, I want a different weapon than that flamethrower. Because it's like so short, uh short range. Oh shoot, might need it for right here. Oh shoot. So this boy's spitting out blue water balloons. And I just love how I have infinite ammo in this joint. Never run out of ammo. This joke is not dying though. Almost got him. Hold up. Oh, you got me. Finally. He's a done deal. Let's keep it moving. Hey, you just keep running and keep your head held down on the trigger. All gas, no brakes. So I got me some more health. Give me that. 
Oh, the spreaders. I remember this joint from the Contra from Nintendo as well as the Super Nintendo. Do I don't have no explosives I can use? How do I? I'm just trying to check and see if I got any explosives. I don't think I do. I'm gonna spread it up. There we go. If I do have a bomb, I don't know how to use that joint. Oh, should have ducked. I'm not trying to get caught up in the fire. So yeah, the contra. Oh, that boy got some ups. The contra adventure. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Don't go out like this. Oh, I got shot in the face. At least I didn't lose my flamethrower. <laughs> What's this? What's this? Give me something dope. Yeah. I don't know what this is. Alright, so let me kill this boss. That gun not shit. Oh! Yo, I don't know if he's trying, he want me to dance. God, wait. Why, hold on, let me. I don't like this gun too much because it's. Shoot. Go back to the basic gun. I'm about to die, yo. This boy got a disco ball on his thing on UFO ship. Let me go ahead and kill him off now. I'm trying to do this thing diagonally. Let's just aim straight on up. Where the other gun at? This flamethrower not doing the business for me. It's not working. And this dude got a lot of health, bruh. Ain't about to kill me again. If I got him, y'all, if I got him. And die already. Now he's dropping the bombs on me for real. Watch out, watch out. Oh, shoot. I jumped right into that. I'm just going to stay. I got full health now. Shoot. Right, I got one more life left. Can I take him out? Bro, he going to. How you crash the ship into me? Gotta jump over that dude. I didn't think he could hit me. All right, so there it is. <laughs> Finally got that dude beat. The Contra Adventure. Lightweight. This right here is Bushido Blade. Gotta be a real samurai to play this joint. All right, so let's go ahead and rock out with the story mode. Okay, so let's see who do I wanna play or what? Ooh, Black Lotus. Nah, nah. Let's go with the Red Shadow. And my weapon of choice shall be... Ooh, Sledgehammer? Nah. Let's work out with the Katana. I need to get one of these for my unboxing videos. A secret Kage. society of assassins. Everyone who knew that was sworn to secrecy. I'm sworn to secrecy I'm out here. To leave the compound. <laughs> but one person broke the code of silence and escaped into the ruins of a deserted castle mm -hmm. in search of the only way out through the castle tower. It's only one way out, B. At best, they'll kill each other. Yeah, we got it. Let's go. And we won't let that happen. I'm with you. 
<laughs> All right. Oh, cut her right in the stomach. She dead. I know her stomach hurt. Ooh. Yeah, this joint right here is a one hit quitter, man. Mikado. Mikado? Who's next? I'm so sorry. <laughs> Let's have a clean fight, no problem. Run away from you like this. Oh, shoot. I tried to catch him with the okie doke. He got that sledgehammer. Oh, good block. Oh, he dies me. I'm trying to catch him. Oh, you missed. Oh, shoot. Let me stop. <laughs> oh. Guy had a good time. Oh, shoot. Let me get out of here. He's about to kill me. I'm trying to catch him and cut him. Oh, shoot. I see you got some ups, boy. We ain't no LeBron James. Come here. Body, you right by these tombstones, bro. Cut him. Dang it. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Back up. Feel like this guy has him training. Oh, shoot. I can't catch him. No, no, no. Cut him. Got him. Got him. Three more for good measure. <laughs> the boy had to fight with one arm, yo. Yaga. 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 <laughs> so, yeah, guys. That's Bushido Blade. This one's for real now. You better back up, little boy. Watch this, watch this. Oh, he said I can run too. Oh, he blocked that. Oh, shoot. Cut him in the top. Told the little boy to back up. <laughs> but yeah, that's Bushido Blade, man. Right on top of the head, bro. Go ahead and see what you got to say, Shouty. Say what you got to say. Mm. Uh -huh. Resident Evil 2. Can't have the PlayStation without this game right here, man. Start a new game. And let's put it on normal. Resident Evil 2. Alright. How do I run? I forgot how to oh, we go. I might get killed real early. Come on, Chris. I mean, Leon, get off of me! Let's see if I can pull this gun. The, the controls are crap. How do I pull the gun out? I forgot how to pull it. I'm about to die. Screw that. Get off me, get off me! Just run right past him, dog. Oh, shoot! Get off me! The controls are so funny. Go, 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 go. Let's go inside the door. Let me inside. That boy holding his hip. All right, so let me see. Let me press something. How do I, oh, gotta press that. How do I shoot? There we go. Freeze. <laughs> My bad, dog. What, what are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! Oh, shoot. <sighs> Sorry about that. Wow. Graphically, guys, we, we have came a long way. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Everybody got that virus, bro. They got that virus. Man, I need some weed. Some health. <laughs> uh, let's see. 
So yeah, guys, I wanted to show you Resident Evil. I didn't know how to shoot right out the gate, but that's how you bust your shots. You gotta hold down that. And that's how you bust off your shots. All right, so. Let's go through this door. Back in the alley. Probably shouldn't be out of this, but. Hey, you on your own, bro. You on your own, fam. My chest hurting. Can I shoot one of y'all? Get back. Get back, boy. Get back. You still up. He got back up. Sit your tail down. So yeah, there it is. Resident Evil, man. Ah, how they broke out. Uh, will you take, yes. Give me those bullets, bro. Now I gotta go back and kill these boys. I thought I shot y'all all these times. Okay, shot. Get down. I got time. Oh, get off me. I'm gonna pass you too. All right, this is where I die, I think. Get out of here, boy. Back up. Little punk. Okay, so next up we got Gran Turismo 2. Let's go ahead and start the game. We already seen the PlayStation 5 conference and that Gran Turismo 7 looks really good. So let's go ahead and single player, road race, put that thing on normal, turn this down a little bit, class A. So we got the Corvette, the Mustang, ooh, and the Lotus. Let's go with the, uh, let's go with the Corvette, bro. Automatic transmission, head to the race. All right, guys. So everybody revving up their engines. Let me switch this camera view. I think I like this view right here better. Let's try to see if I can bag this first place, man. Get out of the way, boy. I look like a Mitsubishi Eclipse. Ooh. Not an Eclipse, a Lancer, I mean. Looks like a Lancer. But since I got this Corvette, I should have the fastest thing on the street. So all I gotta do now is hold down this first place. And the brakes a little bit. Oh, coming in kinda hot. Shoot. All right. So, you can see that these graphics have held up pretty okay over the years. Bro, in the first place, the sixth place, just like that. Just like that. Oh, look at that Lotus. Break a little bit. And you know what? Whenever PlayStation announces their pre-orders, bruh, I got a pre-order day one. Let me know in the comment section below if you're pre-ordering a PlayStation 5 as soon as they announce it. My wife and I both got a pre-order, bruh. Day one. Absolutely. But the only thing I wish is that I hope they have some more colors for the console. I mean, that white and black color scheme that they have is pretty good. Oh, shoot. That black and white color scheme or white and black is pretty good, but I honestly prefer an all black console. That's just me. Because I think it just looks better. I actually have... Uh, the only white consoles I have is the Nintendo Wii, and I actually have a, uh, a European PS3, and it's white. And it, it doesn't look too bad, 
but I prefer to have all black. I actually had a white Dreamcast, and uh, for whatever reason, it messed up on me, and I had to uh, send it into Sega and get another one, and they sent me back the all black sports edition, and that thing is pretty sick. So hopefully, Sony will give us an all black console at launch. I'm sure the console will eventually come out all black, but I just hope they have it at launch. So yeah, this is Gran Turismo 2 on Sony PlayStation on the Mega Cave, and it's running pretty well. I mean, you can see a little bit of hiccups here and there, but for the most part, it's pretty solid. See if I can hold on to this third place for this last lap. And, uh, oh, I'm done already? I thought I had one more lap, yo. <laughs> I did get second place, so there it is. Gran Turismo 2. Sony PlayStation. I don't want to see the replay. All right, so right here, Mega Man Legends. Let's go ahead and start a new game. Here we go. All right. So here we are. Let me turn this up a little bit. It's volume kind of low. Shoot. Okay, that's how we shoot. Wait a second. What's up? Should be a lever bot around there somewhere. You see it? Yeah, I see it. It looks like a small one. You should be able to take it down with your buster gun. All right. Square to fire. Got it. R2 to automatically lock on. Got it. Uh, no. So we lock on like so. Okay, so you have to use R1 and L1 to turn left and right. That's kind of weird. All right. Can take some getting used to. <laughs> turn right there. All right, turn it right here. Can you see a door nearby? Yes, let's go in the door. Do you see a door? Yes, I see the that door. That should be the way out. It's not far from your current position. Okay. O to investigate, got it. Read instructions again, no. So this is obviously the beginning of the game. Come on out of that, boy. Dodging like a mug. Now, do you prefer this kind of Mega Man play or the joints they used to have on, the, you know, on Super Nintendo, Mega Man X and all that? Open Sesame. Watch out, there's something right in front of you. Open Sesame. This Mega Man is pretty, oh shoot. Okay, so we got none other than Metal Gear Solid. Start a new game. Put it on normal. Y'all already know this joint is a classic, but I just wanted to show you. I'm not gonna sit here and play the entire game, obviously, but. where it all started. Snake, Colonel, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What's the situation, Snake? 
Looks like the elevator in the back is the only way up. Just as I expected. I have to take the elevator to the surface. But make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. Got it. When you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to contact you, the codec will beep. When you hear that noise, press the select button. The codex receiver directly stimulates the small bones of your ear. No one but you will be able to hear it. Got it. Okay, I'm ready to go. Let's do it. So it's time to jump into action. Joan is like a movie dog. Crawl up under here. I know he's seen me. <laughs> he doesn't see me. Go right here and hide out. I'm trying to get the buttons together. <laughs> get up. That's punch. Okay. How do I stick my back against the wall? That's not how I do it. When Buddy come back around this corner, I'm knocking him out. <laughs> Matter of fact, let's just go this way. Can I go this way? All right. All right, here go Buddy right here. Oh, they heard me. Now I got to go to work. Come around the corner. <laughs> They see me. Oh, he ain't dead. Give them both that word. Knock him out. Oh, I jumped in the water by accident. <laughs> Man, I trained at the academy. I'm gonna mess around and drown up on it if I can't get out, bro. Get up, get up. Bro, I went up on the water bottle. <laughs> oh, snap. They did not have the swimming mechanics ready back then. All right, let's try this again. Because I put hands on both them boys and they got he got right back up. That's why I went right there. But yeah, Metal Gear Solid. I just wanted you guys to see this joint. Because it's a kid up. Cause it's a classic. Let me go beat this dude up. Go to sleep. You better not get back. How are you getting back up? There you go. Stay asleep, son. You next. Who else? Oh. Oh, he's in there. They coming for me. I'm a dead man. Killed in action. Game over. I'm dead, bro. I'm dead. All right, so guys, there are a ton of PlayStation games in here for you to play at your heart's content. The song better get solid. I ran up and got done up. But anything that you want to play in here is at your fingertips with this Mega King. I mean, there are a ton of games that I didn't even bother to go into. Knockout King. I definitely remember that. But you can just hold this right here and just go for days. Ooh. How many Maddens we got up in here? Madden 2001, 2, 3, 4, 5, Madden 97. They're all in here, man. Marvel Street Fighter uh, versus Marvel Super Heroes versus Street Fighter. You got Marvel versus Capcom. This joint right here, Mary Kate and Ashley. I didn't even know they had a game. <laughs> But yeah, if you want to play some Mary Kate and Ashley, what is this? Crush Course? You can come in here and play that. Yeah, they had their own game, bro. Got some Tony Hawk. Well, that's Matt Hoffman's Pro, Pro BMX. But you know, you got the Tony Hawk up in here. You got the Medal of Honors. All the Mega Man X's. Mega Man X6. I remember playing that on the SNES. There goes those Metal Gear Solids. Turn it down a little bit. Um, 
But yeah, the Mortal Kombat, whatever you want to play on this Mega K for the PlayStation, they're all here. NBA in the zone 98, 99, you name it. Pac Man, Odd World. Let's go back to the O's. So, yeah, this Mega K literally has every PlayStation game I think ever made. I mean, look at this. <laughs> it just keeps going and going, and it just doesn't stop. San Francisco Rush, definitely a hit. But, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Definitely going to have to come back with a part two because the PlayStation library is so large and I want to show off some more of these games. The Simpsons had a wrestling game? Did y'all know that? I never knew that. So yeah, that's, this is it. PlayStation. All right, guys. So there you have it. The Sony PlayStation running on the HQ Mega King. It looks really good. And I know something like this brings back a whole lot of memories. But I'm curious to know, what was your favorite PlayStation game back in the day? Leave that down in the comments section below. I'd like to thank you all for watching this video. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you enjoyed the gameplay, show some love. Give this video a thumbs up. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.